I am from a body that is engineered by dreams. Dreams because I wouldn't be here if my roots hadn't dreamed and migrated for a better tomorrow. I am from a strong black body that bears kaleidoscope babies, rooted and weaved in ancestral dreams. I am from a body that had an abortion and three live births, each one an important decision, but one of them surrounded by stigma and shame. I am from a body that was sexually abused as a girl and liberated with lovers as a woman. I am from a body that is perfect, even if from time to time I want to trade it in for a new one. I am from a body that reflects my powerful and multiracial ancestry. I am from a body that has only just begun to ask the question, only just begun to understand where it came from, when, and how. I am from a body with hypnotic hazel eyes that both say I've had enough and I'm beautiful. We live in a world where we are losing touch with our humanity. Where those in charge do not reflect the experiences or the realities of our communities. Where an individual has to have a nine digit number in order to be considered a human being. Where wealth is abundant, poverty is man-made, and choice is luxury. Where abortion is a right only a name for too many communities because of funding bans and policy barriers. Where preconception care should be valued as much as prenatal care. Where not all people are able to live, love, and be as they are. We will have reproductive justice when all women, all women, have not only the right to make personal decisions regarding their lives and their children's lives, but also the support and respect of their communities. We'll have reproductive justice when men stop speaking up for women and start listening to their wisdom. We will have reproductive justice when a woman can freely admit to having had an abortion. I've had an abortion. We will have reproductive justice when all young people have contraception available without being judged. We have reproductive justice when we all stand together to value the health of all people regardless of gender identity. We will have reproductive justice when we can expect love and support instead of shame and silence. I'm 25. <laughs> That's wrong. That was a curse. <laughs> Um. <laughs> oh my god, are you calling me old? <laughs> start. <laughs> no, start again. Say the word and. <laughs> I know. That was beautiful. <laughs> that was the best one. I know. Uh, <laughs> Rooted and weeded. <laughs> okay, Louis. Yeah. yeah. We gotta, okay. we're gonna get that. Shit. Yeah. Okay. Oh god, it's on the outtakes. Yeah. <laughs>